Hi, good evening everyone. I'm Dr. Tani Ping, consultant obstetrician and gynecologist. Today I've chosen a very interesting topic. Very often I see women who come to me with certain complaints and then I will ask them, um, do you think you could be pregnant? And then they will say, no. Why? They have their funny look in their face. It's like they had their menses. How could they be pregnant? So some of them will even tell me, uh, I just had my period. And I'm like, period also can be pregnant one ma. So you see, a lot of people think that as long as they have their period, then they are definitely not pregnant. So that is not actually true. The situations are number one, we know about implantation bleed. Implantation bleed is a situation where you actually bleed at the time that you're supposed to have your menses. Actually, it's implantation bleed. Implantation bleed means you're pregnant, no? So you can have bleeding and you do not know that you are actually pregnant. But most of the time in these type of cases, their menses may not be very heavy, may be very little. But there are people who often have very little very low flow for their period so they cannot tell the difference whether this is implantation bleed or this is menses so this is what that can happen then there is also another situation some of us may have some polyp may, some ha may have some fibroids may have some adenomyosis adenomyoma and this type of situations you also have a tendency bleed during pregnancy so when you bleed during pregnancy you can bleed on the dot when your period is supposed to come or it may be a bit delayed there is also another situation we call especially nowadays a lot of people do IVF so for IVF they like to take the blood test to check whether you're pregnant or not so when you take your blood to do pregnancy tests it can detect at very very early stages but yet you check oh my blood test show I'm pregnant but after a few days eh, my menses come already uh, these are things is actually could still be biochemical pregnancy biochemical pregnancy is actually very very common then there is also another situation we say abnormal pregnancy abnormal pregnancy means you can be having a miscarriage or a threatened miscarriage or an ectopic pregnancy so when you have miscarriage or ectopic pregnancy you can bleed also so when you have all this bleeding then you may think that uh, I'm not pregnant but actually you can still be pregnant so you can cause um, you can be pregnant but you can also be bleeding so you can be pregnant and you're bleeding in one situation I say uh, biochemical pregnancy but actually you lost your pregnancy already so this thing is actually very very common but so common that we don't know nowadays we know more is because we tend to do blood tests before your period in cases that they do IVF that's why we start to see a lot more biochemical pregnancy so it can be due to pregnancy but bleeding due to abnormal reason abnormal reason means like miscarriage um, it can be threatened miscarriage miss miscarriage or it can be uh, due to ectopic pregnancy which is again ab abnormal uh, pregnancy or it can be due to normal pregnancy but you have something in your uterus Maybe you got polyp, you have fibroid, you have adenomyosis, you have infection. These type of people will keep on bleeding one. So they keep on bleeding until they don't know whether they are pregnant or not pregnant. And last of all, it could be due to certain uh, contraception that you have been taking. It can be oral contraception, IUD, or even emergency contraception. So all these situations can cause you to have continuous bleeding over the months until you don't even know that you are pregnant until 9 months later. So now, uh, any more uh, topics that you want me to talk about, anything that you're interested, please, please uh, put it up in this comment section and then so that I have new topics and new topics to talk. So I need inspiration from you all as well, okay? So do put a note in the comment section. Okay, so that's all for tonight. Okay, thank you and bye-bye.